I'm Father Sony Sebastian. I'm a Divine Word Missionary Priest. It's so nice to share this reflection with you today. Today is January 1st, Wednesday. Jesus said to them, A prophet is not without honor except in his own native place and among his own kin and in his own house. So he was not able to perform any mighty deeds there apart from curing a few, a few sick people by laying his hands on them. He was amazed at their lack of faith. The point is that the people do recognize Jesus' wisdom and his power to perform miracles, yet he is only a carpenter, the son of Mary, and related to James and others. And because they knew him so well, they could not accept him. They deliberately chose not to see what was happening before their eyes. This, of course, is the irony of the whole situation. They did not know him at all. They were blinded by a superficial familiarity. So Jesus says a prophet is only despised in his own country, among his own relations, and in his own house. A saying known to others, other cultures, and an experience all too often repeated in our own day. The trap of familiarity is one we can all fall into very easily. How many times have we failed to recognize the voice of Jesus speaking to us? And because the person is someone we meet every day, a person we may not like or despise. But God can and does talk to us through all kinds of people, believers and non-believers, relatives, friends, a colleague, our own children, total stranger, educated or even uneducated. As a result, we are told Jesus not only did not but could not work any miracles there except for a few sick people who were cured by the laying of his hands. But he could not help those who had no faith in him. Jesus works only when we cooperate and open ourselves to him. Lord, be your help and our guide always, that we may see you in others and be guided by you through my brothers and my sisters. Amen.